Um, I'm William Haas. I'm out of Austin, Texas. My business model, I'm a renovation company um, doing about, um, about half a million dollars a year as of uh, right now. I've been with uh, Four Level Coach just under 30 days. When I first started with Four Level Coach, my goals were honestly to get just kind of get a better handle on my renovation company so I could pull off the uh, tools a little bit more, be able to only do the work that I, I want to do and focus more on and, and growing that side just to get a better uh, sol solid foundation underneath me. And since these last less than 30 days, my goals have absolutely completely changed. I, I'm no longer just trying to sustain my company. I'm trying to make my company where it doesn't need me anymore so that I can now progress to another company or even this one to start taking over spec home building, custom home building, and developing land. Like <laughs> I went from a renovation company just trying to keep my feet, you know, solidly underneath me to now um, a land developer. And that's what I'm starting to call myself. So my biggest fears before starting with four level was honestly like the time commitment, um, the money, if I'm losing money, do I really need this? Is this, you know, I, I, I understand the point of coaching and like, I'm totally for it. And we, we coach everybody. I coach my team members. I coach my subs and even my kids sports. So I, I get that, but you have to see the benefit. And after talking to you and actually sitting through that first call and hearing the other guys, I, I told my wife who, who's my, my, you know, partner in crime and all this. And she was like, you absolutely need this. And I go, I absolutely do. I didn't even realize that. I, and honestly, the, the biggest deal is I don't feel alone and that everybody, all these other guys have dreams and they're excited to, you can hear it. You can listen to them. That everybody's like on the edge of their seat for that next nugget. That's going to get them to their next level. And it's honestly, it's, it's satisfying. It's not people sitting back, just trying to drone and receive information that bounces off of them. Everybody's trying to absorb and be a part and give like the guys have been given from all over the country. These guys have been given other countries guys have been given and it's fantastic yeah the fears i the fears have gone away especially on the time commitment um in these uh last 30 days less than the commitment that I, i've put in you know there's been some nights there's been some days in the afternoon during the work days and stuff when normally i'm, I'm running job sites doing my own work trying to get my guys to where they're at materials and stuff like that and not taking that and the fear was like i'm interrupting that but honestly it made me push me to that point where I have to take that leadership role. And I was like, nope, you have to take this on. And, and it's small things. So even just that was a growth to make me cut that time out. Cutting that time out made me grow as a leader, which, and a manager rather than a tradesman and um, a hand that I'm pretty much was my own hand. Just in those time commitments, it's made me do that. And I couldn't okay. do this. This is less than 30 days, Randy. I know we talked about this and these are all, some of the, those deals were pipe dreams. But after listening to the last conversation this last Wednesday and listening to what, um, what John has done, to listen to what um, um, Jay, um, Michael, the electrician, what he's doing in his stuff, just in his shock and wow and stuff like that, super blew my mind. I was blown away. Daryl talking about, that how they incentivize their people and stuff. I was like, no, these are all heartstrings that people are plucking. They're playing me like a, like a guitar. It's, it's making me sing. And you can't really say that in a big group because we're all burly men and we can't, you know, can't talk about this. But honestly, I was like, these are my people. These are my people right here. These are the people I've been wanting to be around. But you can't because you're not, you can't slow down enough to do it. <laughs> With four level coach, my biggest win so far is um, I got twofold. So I got a personal and then actual business. The personal is knowing that I can manage without being on site, that I can take that. And I, I knew I could, but I just didn't take the opportunity. The time commitment made me manage that in, in small steps. Um, on the business side, um, having a, the success checklist and stuff. So I'm working on my books because that's a, a huge thing where I, I fail. And I, I know I was failing in that. Um, and so 
that's been my first big step. And so I've got a great company that I'm working with. That's a startup helping me build my books. They're a fractional CFO to help me get a solid business plan to help me look at my, uh, how I need to charge correctly and what we need to do where I'm charging too much, charging too little. That's, you know, hurting me and honestly hurting my clients. And we're, you know, I'm there for them and paying my trades appropriately, but having a, a that, that structure, but without that foundation, that, that, uh, the CPN at a uh, fractional CFO can bring in, I, I wouldn't know how to be able to incentivize my guys. You know, it's lunches here and you know, it's nothing standard. Like you said, consistency, it's nothing consistent that they can, they can hang their hat on. If somebody's having a hard time committing or making a, like actual um, the steps to join the program, I, I would, I'd counsel them the same way I would, I would counsel myself. And I was like, honestly, sit through one meeting. If you, if you can sit through one meeting and see what the guys are talking about and seeing what's there and just the flow, most of the guys are doing all the work and you're facilitating. You're giving us the tools and you're giving us the opportunity to work together. And if one person, if they can sit there and see that, it, it, it will pay, it'll pay for itself just in one meeting and you'll see the benefit. For someone who's thinking that they can't afford a program, I would say, you know what, maybe at this moment you can't, but here's the thing. We're not looking, if we focus on this moment, we never grow. We never look at something, anything different. I, I was there and Randy, you walked with me th through that and I'm still working through that. The financial, it, it's not, it's not a, it's not a takeaway. It's a give to, it's an investment. So you're just think of it as I'm putting this money into an account that account is going to give me a return that that return on investment far exceeds anything I could invest in the stock market, anything I could invest in, in real estate, because it's in myself and I, I can believe in me. So it's an investment in yourself. And it was wow. like, if you can sit through a meeting and see that, you're going to understand that. 